Welcome back, Travelers of the Slider Havoc here, and we are back on some Project Ozone 2 Kappa Mode. Yeah. And we did some work. Yes. Nothing productive in game progression so much as just kind of opening up our space and trying to get out of this little corner over here. I just started feeling really cramped the way I had the uh, smeltery and the cold coke oven and the blast furnace or whatever. I was just feeling really kind of cramped over here and I wanted to kind of open things up. So I started and this is, you know, going to be, you know, developing as, you know, time goes on or whatever. But I started expanding on the area that we're going to work in. Eventually, I do want to actually kind of kind of go with like the, the city town concept and get some, you know, grass down and maybe some rolling hills and some trees and all that stuff. I don't want to have just this total industrial stone looking area forever, but for the time being, that's basically about it because I'm not really willing to mass produce dirt yet. It's, I don't know, it's just a whole bunch of leaves and stuff like that. Uh, but I did, as you can see, I actually have uh, two, a completely full cache of rubber wood and then you know one that's about a yeah about a quarter full same with the rubber I made a mistake and I needed some wood I, I was getting really really low on wood and so I went over and was checking my saplings and I was like you know what I did that mega tree and that mega tree was like ridiculously huge and I didn't want to deal with it again so then I saw the sacred tree right and I'm like well okay if the mega tree was the huge one the sacred tree can't be too bad don't ever ever fall for that the mega is not the big tree. No, the sacred tree is. I planted it right around here before I did any of this. This thing blocked out the sun for miles. Like, I swear, if the center of the tree was right here about... Yeah, right around here. It was right here. And I swear the, the awning of the tree went over my mob farm. This thing was massive. It took me close to four hours to get it all down uh, with all the leaves and the wood and stuff like that. It was just absolutely nuts. Don't, don't, don't plant a sacred tree if you don't want the hassle. Now, if you want something cool, you know, by all means, go ahead and plant it. It's a cool looking tree. But if you have going to chop it down, uh -uh -uh, not the one you want to mess with. So anyways, um, we have set up our agricraft because that's one of the major things I want to work on today is getting some of our seeds so we can start heading towards uh, Batania. I believe Batania was the direction we're heading in. Um, oh yeah, let me show you this. So I've done some more of the power stuff through mag uh, Magnetic Craft. Uh, basically, I'm just left with their refinery and then with the um, and, uh, uh, immersive engineering refinery. Those are the two things I'm really left with in power. I uh, still have to go behead a couple withers, and I'm thinking this means take on the wither boss. Yeah, kill the wither boss. All right, so we can get close to that. And then enchantment table, I really... <laughs> I'm going to go do that right now. Why I haven't done it, I don't know. It was like the simplest task, and I saw it, and I was like, meh, meh, don't really care. Didn't really see the connection at the time. Um, but yeah, it, it's about time that I just get that one knocked out. I hadn't even thought about it. I just, I was looking at it right now and I was like, you know, why haven't I done this yet? It's such an easy task. And uh, when we come down here, I'll show you what I've done. So every time I built one of these or made some of the parts for the uh, magnetic craft stuff, I put them up and just kind of saw how they work. The Sterling genera uh, generates or uses uh, fuel and solid fuel and then basically pumps out this guy right here actually puts out a pretty decent amount of energy. Are you? Oh, yeah, I took the fuel out of you. Um, it basically uses steam, pumps the steam into here, and it puts out a pretty decent uh, couple thousand uh, RF per tick, I think. Maybe not, maybe not a couple thousand. It was putting out quite a bit, though. I had it connected over here, uh, the, my capacitor over there, and just kind of testing it out. It puts out a decent amount of energy. Using the coal coke uh, from the blast furnace, or not blast furnace, but the coke oven or whatever, it was burning for a decent amount of time, putting out a decent amount of energy, but I just don't want to waste resources on that when I basically have an infinite source of fuel right here. And I did make myself another one of these uh, next level uh, lava generators just because I wanted some more uh, power because I did put like a whole bunch of like speed upgrades in these things, just trying to produce more, uh, you know, 
ores and stuff like that. And yeah, and so kind of that's where we're at right now. I've got a decent amount of stuff. Um, diamonds, how we're doing on diamonds? Not a lot. Five blocks of diamonds, eighty-five emeralds. I mean, we're we're coming up in the world. It's it's it's. It's a slow, steady pace. I'm really not trying to like, you know, go crazy and mass produce anything yet. So yeah, but anyways, I was coming down here to get a diamond. I should actually have a diamond in here, shouldn't I? Yeah. Oh, just one, cool. I didn't want to have to break down a block just to do that. And then I started putting crafting tables kind of everywhere. So if I need a crafting table, I don't have to like run around and am I doing that? No, I needed two diamonds because the book goes there. That's, that's, that's what I needed to do. Oops, come here. Yeah, it's been a while since I've actually made a enchanting table. Uh, like that? Yeah, there we go. Okay, cool. Achievement, we're good. Thank you. And we'll put you back in here, and when you get a diamond, you'll be done. Cool. So we've got another achievement unlocked, which is cool. Or, you know, another achievement, you know, completed. So we'll go ahead and, uh, I was already on it. We'll select the loot chest. Ooh, that's a half heart. That is a half heart. And I have another half heart right here. Two half hearts. Make a hole. And boop bink. There we go. And cube in there. Cool. So what are we doing here? Um, yeah, so we want to get going on Agricraft. Alright, I'm gonna I'm pretty close to finishing up alpha as you can see and we'll we'll really get to it i probably could i could do this furnace upgrade right now but i'm not overly worried about it at the moment it's pretty simple it's just all the stuff you basically need to turn your uh like the diamond furnace into an electrical furnace that's all Ooh. yeah i was making food i kept freaking starving myself like i just had wasn't eating you know on a regular basis and uh i wasn't making food and so basically i went out and planted a couple seeds, uh, the 10, 10, 10 seeds. It took about 45 seconds and well, maybe a little bit, maybe like a minute, minute and a half. And this like, this like entire row was like full of wheat. And so I took that, made the bread, turned the bread into toast and toast into toast sandwiches. And these things just give such great saturation. It's such a cheap thing to make that heck why not? Right. So, but yeah, we'll come back to that one. Um, but I do want to start going and getting into beta. Uh, cause you can see that making some dye seeds is going to lead us down the path of making, um, the Batania flowers. And I really want to make the Batania flowers so we can get to the, uh, pure daisy and yeah. And honestly, I want the pure daisy for power purposes. It sounds kind of funny, but the other generator, not this one, this is actually the one from Magneticraft, but the other thermal generator that I have running that over there um from instant immersion that one actually i can do uh like snow on one side and yellow yellow right and i just want to see what the the power generated is versus water because water's not the coldest thing so uh yeah so flowers that's what we want to start working on so our next objective is this one is dye seeds so we need some poppy seeds blue orchid seeds orange tulip seeds red tulip seeds as you can see it's a lot of seeds Plain and simple, a lot of seeds, right? And so we're going to want to start breeding. And uh, DU module, there we go. And so what we want to do is make this breeding module and then crossbreeding module. The crossbreeding module is the one I'm really concentrate on right now. The breeding module will help us do our 10, 10, 10s. The crossbreeding module will allow us to start making, um, you know, other seeds. Because, like, if you come over here... You know, we've got a few seeds, but obviously, like, I don't have all those flowers to make all those dyes. And there are recipes to make those, like a poppy seed is made from pumpkin and sugarcane. So then basically, I have to go plant some sugarcane, plant some pumpkin, and uh, let it do some crossbreeding over here and hope for the best. And so we're going to let it do that. So I want to make this first module because, well... That's what we're here for. That's what we're doing. And so module, it's the reason I want to do this one live. Okay. So we've already done these, uh, these farming based modules. That was how I made the farm originally. And oh, by the way, this is actually a second farm. I made a new farm. Um, uh, it took a little while to grind out all the materials, but I, I did some extra. So we got some electrical steel and conductive iron this time, a little bit of backup on it, but yeah, we want to make 
well, I want to make the crossbreeding, right? And so that's just a seed some sticks, but we got to make this farming intelligence. This one is just like the farming station. These took a while, but I've got all the materials to make those. So we're, we're good on that front, but I got to make this guy, right? So it's time to start getting into a little more Ender IO stuff. Now the Z logic controller is quick, fast, and easy. That is made in the slice and spice, which we can do. However, I need to go get, uh, I think it's a witch. I believe it's a witch you have to have. Come here. Come here. Come here. Um, is it a witch? Zombie. Oh, no, this one's a zombie. Okay, that's quick, fast, and easy. So what I need to do... Oh, you know what? I actually was just making it before the episode started, so there should be a whole bunch of uh, quite clear glass or fused quartz. Yeah, may, well, not a whole bunch, but some. I was making some earlier uh, because <coughs> if you remember, I was using safari nets to catch some of these random cows and was putting them in here. Hey, there we go. Over the wall, right? Uh, using these uh, so jailer safari nets, right? But all it said was like move fluid cow. Now, if you put them in the soul vials, it does say fluid cow, but it actually tells the fluid name. So it's like liquid blue slime. That's a regular cow. Bacterial sludge. <laughs> yeah, that's how I pronounce that. Destabilized redstone, brine, heavy water magma fluid and heavy water again okay so I, I i noticed that uh it actually showed the names and i liked that and so um i wanted to uh, switch them over to the soul vials so that's a little bit better than the jailer safari net because at least we know what cow it is and if we need a specific cow for something later then you know we'll be able to do that so let me grab a little solarium y'all i have enough to make 10 of these vials so let's go ahead and do that. Okay, one, two, one, two. There we go. And 10 like that, and bam. So now we've got 10 of these vials, cool. And let us see if we can get lucky enough to catch ourselves a zombie. Um, let me take my magnet off real quick so it doesn't pull all this stuff towards me because I am gonna bust a hole in the glass, so. And I think I need to pull it over this way because this, yeah, this is empty. So it just pulled it out of its range. All right, go. Pull all the stuff over here. There we go. And now, right, no, I'll take my magnet off. There you go. Now you can collect all that stuff up. Man, it just spasses out sometimes, doesn't it? All right, but it's all going in. And yeah, this has actually been, I, I've had this hole in this wall for a while and I keep forgetting to patch it up. I just noticed out of the corner of my eye. Um, it's been pretty productive. I'm getting a, a decent selection of like ender pearls. We're up to almost 400. Some of these dimlets, um, we're, no, no, we have 84 of those. That'd be good when we get into RF tools and trying to create other dimensions and stuff. And, you know, just, you know, a little bit of redstone here, not a lot, but you know, some useful stuff. The Menencio essence, we're starting to get uh, a decent amount of that. And that'll be good when we get into the magical crops or not. Ma you know, ma yeah. Magical crops. Uh, when we want to start making some of the cooler seeds and stuff like that. So, yeah, this is this is a, you know, relatively decent little setup we got going on. So, um, oh, you know what? I'm going to have to replace that glass here. Come here. Come here, XP. Let's see. You know, I haven't even checked how much XP we have. 123, not too shabby. So I got to get away from here. I think I'm going to go ahead and break some of these spikes so a couple of them can live. Like I might. I have to break things so carefully. Um, and yeah, just so I can reach through and uh, smack myself a zombie. So I'll do that so they can't come out. And we'll go over here. Hopefully a zombie survives as we run away. And then if that's the case. Oh. Is it the, oh, that's the same cow. I've been waiting for new cows. I kind of want to get like a gasoline cow just to kind of speed up the smell tree. And I think there's other generators that you can use because we're not in need of a lot of power at the moment, but I do want to start increasing soon. But I think one of these generators, um, it might be the furnace generator, uh, ender generator of the ender pearls, which would be pretty cool. Uh, heated redstone, culinary, potions, solar, TNT, pink, uh, temperature furnace. Yeah, that one runs on fuel, I believe. And uh, 
that one puts out a decent amount of energy, if I remember correctly. Um, yeah, so if we can get some fuel, we can actually, you know, kind of level those up and do that. So, all right, so hopefully we can catch a zombie. I see a creeper. Ah, come on, zombie. Get to the other side. Man, I don't want to... I really don't want to go in here. I, I might... I don't know. I. This is what we're going to do. I just... I have to do this because I want to get the zombies so we can get... You know, get all these guys. I don't want to break extra blocks. Okay. We're just going to get a whole bunch of mobs in here. And then uh, hopefully I can catch a zombie. I might catch a couple of them. Like, you know, get myself a creeper, a skeleton, um, maybe a witch or whatever. And hopefully that. But anyways, while that's going, we need to make the soul binder anyway. So we'll wait. We'll let that uh, fill up with mobs. And let's look at the recipe for the soul binder. Soul binder isn't too bad. Um, four mob heads, which is easy. Some solarium we have. These pressurized fluid tanks, however, I have never made. Um... Oh, please tell me fuse quartz works. <laughs> okay, cool. <coughs> so basically we need two of these. So I need some dark steel, which is um, obsidian, coal, and iron. We can do that. Actually, I might have some in here. Have I made any dark steel? No, seared, titanium, dark steel. Oh, cool. And we need eight of those. So that was easy. And I need eight dark iron bars. Oh, we've already got everything we need. This is awesome. And uh, machine frame, easy. That's uh, four regular steel, four iron barns, and a basic capacitor. I think I have an extra capacitor sitting around here somewhere. So four of you, and four of you. And I think I brought some, oh no, they're in this chest right here. Yes, I knew I brought a couple capacitors with me. And let's make sure I got everything else. Uh, solarium, two of those, and then four heads. Easy peasy. Solarium, one, two, and four random heads, um, one, two, three, and I have a whole bunch of Enderman head over in the farm, so I'll use him too. All right, so, oh, you know what? I moved the QED up here. Much closer, much easier. So, first, we're going to make the machine frame, or whatever it's called and steel ingots there we go and i do want to get some crystals uh to speed this process up a little bit it's not slow right now but we're not really putting in or any kind of high demand or anything like that so it's it's not a huge deal um you okay you are made in here cool oh no i need to go make a couple more fused glass but we'll let the first one start there we go and put you in there. Why aren't you starting? That was the recipe, right? You, like that. Oh, the ingots are there. Do do. All right. Here we go. And we will go. I don't know what a pressurized tank is, actually. Let's go make up some more fused quartz. This will give us three of these, so that'll be cool. Um, quartz, 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 quartz. There it is. So 12 of these. There we go. How you oh, yeah, that's nice and full of mobs over there. That's going to be probably really laggy. Uh, there you go. Get in there. I don't know why I didn't just put them in here, but. All right. Oh. Oh, the way they went in. Okay, that's funny. Okay. All right. So then we've got the fuse cords. We'll have the pressurized tanks, and we'll be able to make the mob binder. And I'm assuming it needs power. I mean,. It's a pretty safe bet, I would say, that it's going to need power. All right. So then it was you guys like this, the machine frame in the middle, two solarium ingots like that, and the four mob heads like that. Perfect. So now that we got the mob binder, all we need to do is go get our mobby that we need. Soul binder. Yay. All right. So... I'm going to come down here for right now. Oh, look at that. Another achievement because we already had the obelisk. And um, I think I'm just going to put you back here. Oh, you know what? I'll put you on top of this for right now. 
because that'll give you power. Right? Because you need power, right? I think you need power. You are connected, so I'm assuming you need power. Yep. And I can actually throw an uh, octetic capacitor in there so we can make a little bit faster too. That'd be cool. But let us go over here and see if we can get ourselves a zombie. This is going to be so laggy, it's not even funny. But I see a zombert right up front. So thank you. Did I get him? Oh! Oh no, John Cena! No! Oh, John Cena creeper. Oh my goodness. Okay. Time to go to town on these guys. So you're going in. Think everything. Oh, you know what? That one conduit may have broken. That that wouldn't be good. Okay, 33 levels. Uh, apparently, I picked up a whole bunch of levels just standing here. So that was quick. All right. Um, let me get my 33 levels back. Oh, you know what? No, I only need 10. Boop. Put all those in there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, cool. So let's get out of here. We can go make this guy, and whoo! Then we'll be able to make that and start it up. Oh man, I'm just I, I get so thrown for a loop on stuff like that. Uh, there you go, ten levels. Oh, that was much faster than I thought it was going to be. Okay, cool. And let's just throw you away for right now. I just want to get this stuff done. Um, take my magnet off. Oh, my magnet is off. Okay, cool. Let's jump up on the wall and clear out our inventory real quick. This is like my trash can here. So get rid of all you guys. Do not throw that guy away. All right. Any other junk? Solarium? No. But all of you are good to go. Yes. Okay, cool. Now I can actually put my magnet back on. I need a magnet that I can turn on and off. But for right now, I'm cool with what we got. I, I will work it. All right, so in here, I have you and you, which I'm going to need. And I think I'm gonna have to go make two more of those machine frames, actually. Uh, so let's see this thing again. It is the module. So I'm making this guy, which means I need to make eight of these. So, and that makes eight. So I need to make two of these. So two more of those machine frames. All right, one, two, and do I have enough steel? Yes, obviously I have enough steel. Um, I need eight of you and ooh, need to make a couple more bars. I can't remember, is it one, two, three, four, five, six, whatever. Was it these ones to make the dark iron bars? No, it's not. The dark iron bars are different. Dark iron bars are made with dark steel. Okay, and I have some of that in here. Um, this one? Yeah. Okay. So that's good. So we've got everything we need. Except for the fact that it's not these I need. <laughs> it's regular iron bars that I need. Uh, which I do have eight. Okay, cool. Silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. Okay. So one two 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 and then oops and the basic capacitor we'll get those done up real quick and then I think the rest of it is all just vanilla crafting if I remember correctly um yeah that's all vanilla that's all vanilla yeah 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 so we're good okay cool so we will get this and then we will get these starting to breed and crossbreed. I think crossbreed, that's what we're trying to do. Um, okay, so, oh, you know what? Let me grab all of this here. That should be enough. I don't think, it's not quite two stacks, that's what I need, so. Um, yes, I need 80 you. Oh, iron. Oh, iron. We use a lot of you, that's for sure. Good thing I've got plenty. All right, so you, one, two, there's 16 of those, perfect. And you, um, I think it's 32 of these that we need. I think that's the right math. 
there we go and a little bit you know for extra then I need to grab some sticks one two three four five six seven eight there we go and now we should be good to make you like that perfect and then to make that perfect intelligent farming cool and then we want to crossbreed so I just need a seed and a stick a stick and a seed and that should be it crossbreed right yep all right and then what was the very first one I was looking for poppy 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 so poppy was made with uh, sugarcane and pumpkin which means I'm actually gonna have to grab some sand but I have some pumpkin I think yes I have pumpkin and actually we're gonna do it like this so pumpkin and sugarcane I have sugar oh no sugarcane seeds are down here yes so two of you I have not leveled up my um, pumpkin seed yet so actually who breeding how what's the recipe oh you know what if I do the breeding one, I think I'm going to need that other one again. Um, gets kind of pricey to make these modules. Breeding. Oh, no, no. That's actually simple. That's just one of those. We can do that. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. That's what I want to see. All right. So two sticks and then just one of those guys, which is really, really easy. Okay. Um, so I've got the dark steel. I need six pieces of iron like so there we go and i need one more basic capacitor um yeah nope wait why can i think of the recipe right now yeah, 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 yeah. just one of these will work okay um yes no wait <laughs> My brain is going crazy. Okay, this guy, this guy, uh, just one. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That gives me eight of those. That's what I wanted to make sure. Okay, so you, 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 and you. I'm like I said, I'm getting used to these recipes. Getting very used to these recipes. Okay, you go there, and then I've already got the conductive iron and the electrical steel, so we're good there. I've got the organic gel. Yeah, we're good to go. We are so good to go. And then we'll be able to breed too. And that should like level them up and stuff like that. I believe you have to put the smart one in there. I'm not sure. I'm not 100% sure, but we'll see. Um, I've got iron. So breeding, you. Um, yep. One, two, three, four. Cool. Oh, of course, there's not enough room for you. Whatever. Um, you. Okay, let's try that again. Breeding, you and you. What? What? Oh, I gotta make the other part. I gotta make these. <sighs> Get out of here. Okay, there we go. Eight of those. Cool. One there. We'll just put the rest of the stack there. And now <laughs> we should be good. What? What's going on here? There we go. Just like so. And I'm going to need one more stick. Okay. And now we can make you. And then we can go plop these guys in there. Um, oop. There we go. And where's that? There it is. All right. Cool. So breeding. So first we're going to try to breed these pumpkin seeds up. So let us add this module. The breeding module. Um, oh, okay. So that's module storage. Okay. Okay, that's not quite. Okay, it's in the wrong checker pattern. It's off by one block. Oh, that's so funny. Yeah, because these are the ones that are supposed. How? Yeah, on, off, on, off. No. Off, on, off, on, off. Yeah, it's doing it weird. I don't know. Let us put the seeds in and see what happens. Um, so we're going to put you there and there and there and there. Whatever. 
Um, there's two seeds. Let us see if this actually breeds properly. I just put seeds in there. What are you talking about? Oh, there you go. Wait, you shouldn't be... Shouldn't you be planted on the outside and then... Let me go grab my watering can real quick. I mean... Let's speed the process up a little bit just to see if we can get these to work. I really want to be able to do this. Okay. Yes. Oh, I know. You also don't, you're not getting water because your water source is downstairs. Let's, that's going to speed this up drastically. Let's go grab that real quick. I have you down here because I was testing this other thing out and you don't need to be down here anymore. And we can go put you back up on top where you belong. Like so. There we go. Sprinklers are rocking and rolling now. Let's get these to grow up. Okay. I don't know. I don't know if I have to have the seed analyzer one in there too. Or what. But you're not... Oh, I see. I mean, that makes sense. It's just letting me get more seeds. Okay. So there's going to be more stuff I'm going to have to do, obviously. Um, but it's going to put all those down like that, and they're going to breed up. I need to do the seed analyzer so it can actually analyze the seed and put... Yep. Okay. So we're not going to bother with that right now. Um, we're going to go ahead and go with uh, this. So we're going to go with crossbreeding. Hey, chill out, chill. Oh, is it claiming those pumpkins up? It sure is. Okay. So seeds, we're just going to go ahead and put, just pick all this up. Yes. All you guys come here. There we go. I'm learning as I go here. Um, sticks. Oh, um, something I can drop that I don't need at this very second. Oh, this axe, whatever. I just want to throw those in there. Okay, cool. Should pick my axe right back up. There we go. Okay, so seed storage. So we have sugarcane. And we have that. And then under the modules, we're going to put the crossbreeding module in. Okay. That's not crossbreeding though. Crossbreeding module. It should be planting. What? What is going on? Maybe because the other module was in there first. I don't know. Let us, let's tear this down real quick. You are supposed to do that. Oh, seed one, seed two. There it is. Okay. I just, I had the wrong module in when I planted it. Not a problem. All right, cool. So I wonder if this takes those sticks down and collects them back. I don't know. Let's watch it go through a cycle. If it works, then awesome. All right, guys. So we're almost done with the seeds. I'm actually on my very last one for this uh, uh, particular quest. As you can see, I have gotten all these done. I am just waiting on a pink, pink tulips or something like that. And so hopefully those will come up any moment now, but I do want to start working on something towards kind of getting like, you know, organized and stuff like that. I know applied energistics is a long ways away, but I was doing a uh, little search for like, you know, other options. And I found this guy inventory panel. People were saying it's similar to the, the applied energistics thing. I mean, it's obviously not the same, but it's similar to, um, but the problem is, uh, it takes this nutrient distillate or whatever it's called. What's it? Nutrient distillation. All right. And I have no idea how to make that. Oh, it's in the vat. Yes. So we have to make a vat, right? And I believe it's actually called the vat. If I remember correctly. Yeah. All right. So we got to make the vat. The vat is actually pretty easy. A couple electrical steel, a gold furnace, fluid tanks. I think those are the ones we already made with the glass. Yes. Tungsten. Oh, no, I haven't made this yet. 
So is that two flow tanks? Oh, yeah, it was pressure tanks I made. A crucible. Yeah, we can do that. Um, yeah, so we can make this one up pretty easily. And hopefully we can get a like a, some some kind of organization. I already set it up. I don't know if you guys noticed as I was walking around. I set up the drawers over there. And I was like so ready to do this. But uh, I really wanted to get going on the flowers too. So have I got my tulips yet? Mm -hmm. Tulips anywhere? Tulips? Dandelions? Pink tulips. They're done. Cool. No, 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 no. Complete. Come on. You should like ring complete. Tulip. Yeah, you're right there. Yay. Um. Yeah, there you go. Oh. Oh, man. I didn't even get a loot chest for that. I was really hoping there. All right. So there's you. There's you. So there's all the flowers that we need. Okay, cool. And... I'm going to go ahead and throw the excess away for right now. <clears throat> and yeah, we're going to get going on the vat. So the vat didn't look too uh, too difficult. I just need to get a couple pieces of glass. Uh, one, two, right? It's one piece of glass for these. Come here. Yeah, and then dark iron and tungsten, which I believe I have plenty of. Um, I made a whole bunch of carbide, but I still have tungsten in here somewhere. There we go. So I need eight of these, and then it just so happens that I recently made these, so we're good there. Eight of those, two pieces of glass. We can go ahead and make those guys real quick. So it was like that, and which one was it? Top, bottom, left, right, which one? Oh, no, not you. Um, okay, so the corners is the tungsten. Okay, so you guys go like that. Tungsten goes around and cool. You're cooking up. Then I need to make another machine frame, which means I'm going to need another basic capacitor. And this one is with regular steel and iron bars. There we go. So I'm going to make that bad boy up. And I, there's one I was kind of ignoring. Uh, well, not ignoring. I'm just didn't look at the recipe on. I saw an Enderman head thingy, and I think even if that's in the soul binder, it's fine. Uh, now that we got that, um, oh no, this is it. The vat. Yep. Okay, gold furnace, iron furnace, regular furnace. All right, so we need to go get ourselves some cobble real quick, and we can make that guy up like simple like. All right, one two, and put you in here like so I just need eight of you there you go so eight furnace let's go make the iron for is there room to put you in here oh I got some of them back in not the whole stack but it's okay um, iron and then gold and we are just we're, we're heading in the right direction and that's that's the the best thing I can say about all this is we are heading in the right direction. Uh, I only have three gold here. I need to go get more gold from over here. I've got it over in the smeltery. And man, I freaking flight can't come soon enough. Like seriously, it just, it just can't. I am so ready to be able to fly and get around a whole lot quicker. Oh my goodness. You are just wasting sticks and you know, stop that nonsense get these seeds out of here yeah no no you need to stop you need to stop i will figure this farming system out i mean i i kind of got it under control a little bit little something something but uh yeah that thing's just going out of control there all right uh let's clear all of you guys out like 64 seeds all of a sudden that's just nuts all right cool there we go give me those yes now that you have no seeds in you, I don't care about the dyes being in there. Um, all right, cool. So you're good to go. Sorry, sidetracked, but you know what? When I hear like wasting materials and stuff like that, <clears throat> I've got a lot of materials, but I don't want to waste what I have. So, um, yeah, there you go. And you, there we go. All right, what else did we need? Um, oh, the machine frame. Wait, didn't I just make that? Oh, yeah, I just made that. 
So what else did I need? Oh, crucible. I think I have an extra crucible in here. Yep, I should have. I was like, I should have it a couple of them actually. And four electrical steel. Got that. One, two, three, four. All right, let's go make this bad boy here. Now that I got that machine frame, yes. So you go there, there. Can I remember this all accurately? I doubt it. Four electrical steel on the edges. Oh, I did do it right. Awesome. So now we got to make this nutrient distillate distillation. All right, all right. So we're gonna go downstairs and throw this on the power. And I'm actually because I'm not farming at the moment. I'm gonna go ahead and grab you. Hey, come here. There we go. Because this is how it's gonna get water. And then, oh, you know what? I've got a whole bunch of zombie flesh around here. This is where we're gonna get the the fuel for it, yeah. Because, yeah, 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 that's right. Um, do I have any more zombie flesh? Nope, but I can always get some from over there. I know I've got a ton in the farm. So, let us put this vat down. And, you know what? We're gonna put you right on top. We're just keep stacking. There we go. And I don't know if this water source block is gonna work or not. Let's see. Yes, it does. Cool. And then you like that? No. Hmm. Nutrient distillation. Oh, I have to have a head too. Okay, so heads plus the zombie flesh. Okay. Um, dump input tank. Dump output tank, no. But I'm going to hook a tank up to this. Is it, wor like, I don't know. Is it working or what? Recipes. Hooch, nutrient distillation, okay? So I can use meat. This seems like it's mushrooms, netherwort, sugar I have, fermented eyes. Okay, well I have sugar. I, I guess there's a better recipe, but what? 1.5 for netherwort, one for sugar, one and a half for mushrooms, and one and a half for netherwort. Uh, fermented spider eyes, I guess I could do. Well, I don't have the mushrooms, so let's go grab sugar. I've got some sugar over at the farm from Witch's Drops. And hopefully we'll be able to do this. Wow, there's a lot of mobs in there. Sugar. I've got 107 of them. So that, well, that's a good start. Let me actually... There we go. I only can do a stack at a time. So, oh, you know what? Let me do a full thing of uh, uh, you, though. All right, cool. So then we're going to get some nutrient distillation, and we should be able to do that sign, and then I'm going to have to mass produce this stuff, but that shouldn't be an issue. Now that we've got this, we've got the easy way to power it, and we should be able to get this, this inventory thing done. So sugar. Okay, it took it. Oh, look at that. It was actually pretty quick. It just went right in there. All right, we're gonna run over and grab one of our, well, I need to eat. Oh, let me put some more of this in here too. You got a full stack of sugar, let's do a full stack of you. There we go. Um, I've got the drums over at the smeltery, and so we can just run off the distillate into there, or I could, well, yeah, that's gonna be kind of far. Let's fill up a drum first and see how that goes. Um, what is in here? Molten zinc. Why are you, why are you filled with molten zinc? I don't know. Uh, drums. There you are. And then I can run over here and grab a fluid conduit. And we are rocking and rolling. We are definitely headed in the right direction. Um, yeah. Cause if I can start organizing some storage, <sighs> happy days are here, my friends. Okay. Let's go ahead and just put you here, like that, and there. Yeah, there you go. You're gonna be, insert, you're going to be export. There we go, there we go. 
Oh, look, it's just going now. It is just filling. Just pumping it out. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I like to see it. Okay, and I have a bucket on me. So now we can make this. Okay, cool. So I've got my bucket of that. Now we just got to go look at the rest of the recipe there. Uh, what was it? I was making an inventory panel or something like that. I'm curious about this thing because I've never seen it before. Okay, so Vibrant Crystals are a player core plus Vibrant Alloy. Remember, that's um, Energetic Alloy and Ender Pearls. Whew, I don't know if I made some in a while. Um, I might have some up here. Energetic Alloy. Energetic Alloy. No, but I can make a couple. How much do I need? Um, let's look at that again. Okay, so I need two of these crystals. Okay, first of all, what are you? Oh, that's simple. That's simple, simple. Um, but I'm going to need 16 of these. And these are made... Well, let me see over here. Uh, Ender Pearl and Energetic Alloy. So I'm going to need 16 ingots. So I'm going to have to go grab a little more gold. But we got this. We got this. And I've gotten a habit of now, if I see any animals other than cows, I kill them. Because I really want cows to spawn so I can start getting some of the move fluids. I just haven't had a whole lot of luck uh, with move fluids lately. So we're hoping that we can get more. And uh, uh, the less animals here, the more likely the, you know to spawn and stuff like that. So I just slaughter everything that's not a cow, basically. Even in the vanilla cows, I've been slaughtering every single vanilla cow I see. So you are really full. Oh my goodness, I totally forgot about that. It blew the a conduit, and so it's not connected. <laughs> I gotta remember to bring one over here. Um, Ender Pearls, though. I need 16 of them. Let's just grab a whole bunch. <laughs> I say grab a whole bunch, and I stop at 15. Okay. Yeah, so I need to remember to bring an item conduit over there and replug that back in, because that chest is absolutely, or connected absolutely nothing right now. Um, oh, and back down to the alloy smelter, uh, glowstone and redstone are down here. So did I grab two? No, there we go. What do we call it? There we go. And redstone's back here. Yes. Okay, cool. So I kind of like, I mean, it's, it's not really a necessity, but whenever I'm, uh, I was mass producing stuff, I would literally just run up throw whatever I had in here, it would just pump in and then make whatever I needed. So it was kind of cool. Um, there you go. It's like, what are you waiting on? All right, cool. So that energetic alloy is going to get going. Let us grab one, two, and then lapis blocks. Yes. Okay. So let's make you up real quick and make these player cores and we can get going on those gears while the alloy stuff is going. Okay, so we got these two player cores, and what was that other thing? Um, these things. Oh, wait, hold on, this one. Oh, no. What do I need? I need a witch with a ender resonator. Okay. Ten levels, not bad, but I need to get a witch. I can probably do that. And that is, that's pretty simple. That's simple. We can get to that in a second. What about you? Oh, no. No, 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 no. I'm going to need four more per so i'm going to need oh well shoot what is that now so that's i'm going to need 16 more of these vibrant which would be 16 more of the energetic but i'm going to need 16 more of the energetic so i need 32 more energetic i gotta go get some more gold i mean i've got all the resources i just it's, it can be time intensive that's i mean you know grinding all this stuff out or whatever so I need 32 more gold. So that's uh, 9, 18, 27, 36. That'll work. And then the redstone and the glowstone, that's easy. That's all over there. And then I'm going to have to go get more ender pearls. But that's, once again, that's really simple. So what I might do here is um, pause because right now we're right, right at that hour mark. And I don't want to go too far over. So we're going to pause right here until I get all this stuff uh, made up. And then once it's made, we'll be good to go. So, pink, pink, pink. 
Yeah, it's in there. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and take a break here and then we're gonna get that panel together and see if everything works. So we'll be right back. All right, guys, uh, this has been like the longest wait of waiting for a witch. I actually just finally got the first one a second ago. And as I was cleaning the house, the stinking son of a no good brother, he walked right in front of the door as I was shooting at it. And basically, because I need to catch him in a soul vial, right? So let me, wait, I want you to despawn. I want you to stay right there. I've got all this stuff on me. And what I mean by stuff on me is all the stuff I've been collecting as I've been trying to uh, wait for this guy. Okay, so we're going to do this. Okay, we're going to leave you there. There we go. We're going to clean this house. Do not walk in front of that door again. So I punched a hole so I wouldn't do the same mistake I did with my creeper last time. Oh, you could throw whatever you want at me. Just don't walk in front of my arrows while I'm killing all these guys. And, uh, anyway, yeah, this is, oh, this has been a hassle, but as soon as, you know what, I'm just going in for it. Um, I don't have an empty spot. There we go. Going in for it. Come here. Come here. No, no, no. Okay. Oh, that's okay. I'm okay with that. The hopper took it. The hopper took it. All right. Let's clean this house. Let's go get that, uh, soul vial out of there. Right. Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? I saw the hopper take it. Come here in there somewhere. Where's the soul vial? Where's my soul vial? Still in the chest? Oh, man. So long awaited. Oh, come on. Just... <sighs> Where's the soul vial? Haha, -ha, there it is. Okay, cool. Uh, Minencio... You can go there. That will free you up. Oh, what? What are you doing? Come on. Are you both full? Oh, you're both maxed out. Um, hmm. Okay. We'll just get rid of you. I just... Give me my soul vial. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. No. You still... <gasps> there we go. Got it. I have been waiting for that thing for so long. To make, oh, ooh, stay away. To make this, this bad boy over here. But the nice thing was I got some levels in the process, so. And you, you go in there, you go in there. Clicky, clicky. Oh, we got you. We are so close. Oh, okay. Um, oh, this is over at the QED, I think. Right? QED? Yes. We've got everything, though. We have it. It took a pretty long while. It took me blowing up my spawner. It took oh, just all sorts of crazy stuff. But if I can start having some kind of organization system, that will be amazing. Oh, goodness. I've been in need of this for a long time. Getting organized. Come on. Yes. All right. Thank you. Let us go get some item conduit because I believe, oh, I should probably close that back up. Just throwing that idea out there. Might be a good one. Uh, let's see. So I, I like had this place whole set up and ready for this. Um, you're right there, right? And then I can just put you in here. Can I, can I do that like that? Sure. Um, offline. Any I sync disabled filter cards. Oh, I can craft. I didn't know you could craft in there. What's this? Uh, nutrient. Oh. Oh, do I need... Do I need this tank over here? Well, you've got a good amount in you. Um, let me grab a bucket. Let me see. And let's go put some, some items in here to make sure that this is working properly. So let us just grab a couple things here. Uh, we'll put some heads. There we go. So put some toast right there. There we go. 
some vibrant alloy and we'll put a monster's head over here okay let us see if this is working oh i will be so happy i can start putting down some i mean it's not ae but you know what it's a step in the right direction um i kind of want this to be one higher but whatever if i do i do this Do I just, should try click? Oh, hey. Oh, there we go. Okay, so you've got some in there, um, but you still say offline. How do I get you online? Something about a remote awareness upgrade. I think it's this thing. Yes, um, I've got all that stuff, that's easy. It basically said anything that has that installed. So that's what we need. We need you. Man, that was a huge, huge amount of time that we could have had this thing done. Uh, steel and then binder in that. Okay. Um, you're here. One, two, three. Binders on me. So I got to install you. <clears throat> okay. Well, that's cool because now I know. Now I know for the future that I got to add that thing. Uh, I don't need the power source, so I can take that out. Um. I'm just gonna, there we go. Okay, cool. And there we go. I just need to put you in like so. Online. Oh, oh look, 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 we have a filter system. We have an inventory system. Oh, this is making me so excited right now. So, so excited. We have an inventory system. I can put stuff in. Look at it go. Oh, oh, oh. And why does it say I only have four? I just put like a whole stack in there. Oh, there we go. It just took a second to update. Oh, this is so cool. Sort items. By, oh, yes. And then if I type like zombie, yes, it works just like, oh, that's awesome. Can I say this is something I want to auto craft such as, oh, I don't know. Oh, here we go. Let's do this. We'll put that in there. And let's look up a facade. Uh, this one right here. Like so. And it auto populates. Oh, this is awesome. This is so awesome. So happy. Now I just got to go clean house over there. But oh my gosh, guys, I hope you're as excited as I am. Well, maybe, maybe not. I mean, if you've already seen someone else do that before, then that's awesome. And you probably won't be nearly as excited as I am, but I've never used that panel before. And now I can put down a whole bunch of chests because I got plenty of wood to do that. And we can start getting organized. All that nonsense over there can get organized and all the yeah, organization. Getting rid of all these chests right here and finally having a nice clean area to work in. I am so excited right now. There are just no words. There are no words for how excited I am. You know what? I I, psh, I just thought about it. I remember hearing a whole bunch of unlocks. Okay, so I know we can start doing that stuff and I'm gonna, I'm gonna start doing the Batania stuff in between episodes so we can really get into Batania next episode. But I did hear a whole bunch of stuff go cha-ching, cha-ching, cha-ching when I was making some of the Ender I.O. So, ha, there they are. The Vat was a mission. Awesome. Um, the Soul Binder was a mission. Awesome. And the Obelisk was a mission. See, some of the stuff I was actually head on. Um, whatever, just give me a concentrate. I don't, I don't really care. And anything else? Anything else that I've randomly done that I didn't know about? Nope, I look like I'm pretty well caught up. All right, cool. So, guys, I hope you guys are enjoying this series. I am having a lot of fun. I love the challenge. It's something totally new and totally different. And I am so digging on it. So digging on it. And I hope you guys are too. And if there's anything else you guys want to see, let me know. If there's anything else I need to know about, let me know. And if you're just really frustrated because I make stupid choices when I'm playing and I shouldn't be, let me know. Like, you know, get in touch. Put the word out there. And I'm going to go ahead and open up a couple of these loot chests real quick before we finish up. Yes, yes we are. Hopefully I get some good stuff. Come on, loot chest number one. Um, Nonsense. Um, alchemical coin, transmute EMC source. Oh, I think that's something later. Um, 
Eh, glowstone. Meh, meh. Sewage floor. Yeah, thanks for that. That's awesome. Well, guys, until next time, y'all know the deal. If you want to see more like it and you're brand new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoyed what you saw, please don't hesitate to hit that like button. And until next time, I am Slider Havoc, and I am out of here. Peace.